Hey guys and welcome back to another DaVinci Resolve quick tips. Today we're going to talk about how to do a speed ramp. So let's just get into it. Here I have a clip of my dog running after a ball. This was filmed in 120 frames a second, but if I play this back, it just plays back as if it was at normal speed. So what we want this to do is play back in slow motion. So the first thing we're going to want to do is right click on the clip, go to clip attributes, and then here you got video frame rate and you wanna change this to the speed of your project. So if it's 30 frames a second, change it to 30. Mine is at 24 frames a second, so I'm gonna change it to 24, hit okay. And now if I play through this, let's skip forward, you can see that it is now playing in slow motion. Fantastic, so what we're gonna do is we're just going to set some in and out points. So we're gonna set an in point there and just set an out point there and drag the video down like so. Next thing we're gonna to wanna to do is to enable time remapping. So we right click on the clip and go retime controls and you'll have the shortcut there. So command R on a Mac, I think it's control R on a PC. And here you see we have a arrow that indicates what direction the clip is going. So if we reverse that, the clip would go, the, the arrows would point the other way. And we can see that it is currently playing at 100% speed. So what we're gonna do is have this front section here of the clip go really fast. And then when she jumps, we're gonna make it go slow motion. So about there, this is where we're gonna want it to start the slow motion. So we're gonna hit this down arrow here and go add speed point. And then we're gonna go forward and we're gonna say that after she's jumped, so say there, and we're gonna have it speed right back up. So we're gonna add another speed point. So now we have our clip split into three sections. What We're gonna leave this one at 100 because that's the slow motion, but this one here we're going to down change speed and we're just gonna go 800%. So that's gonna be 800% times the current speed. And we're going to do that on the other side. Now, contrary, if we were to go you know, below, that would slow it down. So now if we play this clip back, you can see that it speeds and then goes really quick, but it's really harsh. And that's because if we look at the speed graph, it is not a smooth ramp, hence, we wanna create a speed ramp. So right clicking on the clip, now that we've added our points, we're gonna to go to retime curve. And this is gonna bring a graph. So if we grab our split here and drag it down, we have a graph. And at the moment it isn't quite right. And that's because it's set to the frames. We want this set to the speed. So we hit that down arrow there, click retime speed and disable retime frame, click away. Now we have our keyframes here. And as you can see, it is quite a hard cut. So it goes really quick, and then automatically goes really, really slow. And we wanna smooth this out. And that's really easy to do. Select the keyframe and just hit this one here. And this just smooths the graph out like so. And now if we play it back, it's a much, much smoother transition. And we can grab these handles here just so that it's a faster ramp. Now taking this one step further, Currently the limit for having this retime speed is set to 900, that's all we can see, and that's that number here. But if we click that number and drag, you can see that the scale of the graph changes, and that allows us to drag that retime speed right up, right up to over 2000% times the original speed. And that can be, you can go higher if you want, you can go way higher, but for the purpose of this exercise, let's just drag this right up to 200%. And if I play this now, yeah, you can see it goes really slow and really, really quick at the end there. And to close it all down, it's really simple. You just disable the retime curve and you can grab your splitter here that divides the video and audio and done. That is how you do a speed ramp in DaVinci Resolve.